congratulations, Coach. You, you get a close win here this afternoon against Virginia, who you beat earlier in the season. Can you talk about tonight's performance? I, I thought it was one of our uh, best uh, 90 minutes that we played. Um, I thought we were very solid. Um, defensively, I thought our pressure was very good. Didn't give many good looks. Um, and uh, attacking-wise, we created enough chances. Unfortunately, you know, uh, we made it closer than it needed to be. I think if we had took advantage of some of the chances we had in the first half, um, they might have opened up the game a little bit. But um, all in all, I thought it was a really complete effort by our guys. I was proud of that. What was the mindset coming into this game, knowing that you had already beat them in the past? Like, did you kind of just like want to stick with the same game plan as you did before, or did you try to mix it up? Well, you know, we're we're cognizant of the fact that um, you know they they printed in their own. Uh, newspaper or on their own website that they were looking forward to come back and rectify the, um, the loss earlier so we knew that they had a little bit of juice uh, going into it um, so it was so important how we started the game and I thought we started the game very well um, I thought we got on top of them early um, gained a, a good amount of possession created some opportunities um, and I think that set the tone for the game and uh, that that for us we felt was going to be very very important did you make any changes in the, uh, in the second half knowing that you were creating chances but not putting any away and knowing that Virginia was probably going to come back strong? Not, not really. I, I think for us, the depth um, of our team has helped us all, all year long. And, um, you know, that was the mindset going into the second half, which just continue to get fresh fresh people on and continue to wear them down. Um, and I, I think we, we did a good job. The guys coming in off the bench helped us. I thought Adrian was very good. Shreep, especially in the second half. And, and moving DJ around and putting him in different spots, I thought he was very effective today. When you're defending, uh, there was always a uh, step that always make, like a big, the big save to preserve the lead. It was Michael who actually made a game saving tackle tonight. Uh, can you talk about his performance? Well? I'm glad he's healthy. I mean, you know, I'm glad he's playing. Um, Michael's been great all year. Um, you know, he has such athletic ability that when things go wrong sometimes, he has the ability to make it up. Um, and he did tonight. Um, I'm, I'm glad for him. And um, it's just indicative of Mike. He has that ability to change the game like Tim did on the attacking side. He can on the defensive side. Knowing how, uh, that, knowing how high the stakes were in this match, how important was it to get the first goal? We, we talked about that. You know, the percentage of games won when you score the first goal is, is very, very high. And especially in, in tournaments where it's a one-off, um, I, I would imagine it might even be higher still. Um, so we, we talked about that, the importance of getting the first goal tonight or today, and, and um, yeah, it paid off. You traveled to Wake Forest on Wednesday in the semifinals. You lost the previous four meetings, I think Tim, Tim, Tim said, in the end of your season last year. How do you uh, travel there and try to get the win and try to get the win? Well, I, I think if we, if we continue to play with the same energy that we played tonight, um, the same discipline, um, I, I think that um, there's nobody in the country that you know we can't beat anywhere. Um, having said that, what we also know is they're going to be a really good opponent. Um, they're, they're not giving up a ton of goals. They don't score a ton, but they don't give up a lot. and um, they, they love the possession. Um, so we're going to have to find a way to disrupt them a little bit see if we can get on the ball so can you talk about Tim's goal yeah it was it was something we train um, you know all restarts are not only about the first ball it's the second one as well um, so whether it's a corner or a free kick that if you're playing one in um, and you don't win it you probably if you're positioned well can get a second one and um, Tim took one on top of the box and, and buried it it was a good finish by him um, but also pretty good service to, to put it in a spot where their clearance, you know, fell right to, right to Tim.